because they benefit a lot from the armor. They farm it faster. And the Chen, like you said, either goes for a medallion or solo crest build up, or in some cases, your Chen to actually just make things work. Me on top lane here, Ty Hunter should be okay. He's gonna get dive slow, slow down. Level one. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, level one. That's done. Into a lane strikery. Yeah. How did he get caught there? Delina needs follow up. He, no one is even near him right now. He needs the gyrocopter 100%. Well, he's stalking him right now. But here comes the, the radiant support. Hand of Ghana is online, so you gotta factor in mind. Factor that in mind. Maybe you could go for the Chen kill. Oh, they see each other. Here we go. It's going to be Polygon coming in. Rabbit's going to come out. Hand of God will be used. It's going to be Fan taking a ton of damage in return. The mech's going to come through on the other side. And Old Chicken is running to the left. Fiery Birds are coming in. So will Hook and a actually really good Supernova in the background. Laguna Base is going to drop. Looks like the Juggernaut is dead automatically. And Wings really over committing after that Ravage. Ty Hunter forced to retreat as well. I think he will die. Rubik doing a little bit of help here. They might actually pick up Lian. No, they won't. It's going to be four dead. At the end of the fight, could be five because Shen's big stock as well. Nice push to the left. They're still chasing him, and they will finish the Rubik. So four for one exchange after using the Ravage. I think they, uh, like you said, they overcommitted for sure. Blink out! I think oh. he oh, blink at Reno. He's gonna make it home. We got Blink Dagger coming in from the Rubik as well. It's just still chaos, and somehow EP is kind of in the fight despite getting three man Ravage right in the get go. Meanwhile, Old Chicken's running right in, and it's gonna be a oh, throw into the Requiem. Old Chicken pops the PKB, but will die thanks to the Scotty. Meanwhile, on the high ground here, the Phoenix is gonna go down as well. Fan will pop the drum and run away. Uh, looks like the clock's gonna go down as well. I mean. I'm not sure why they chase though, Horn. So the difficult part for EP is they know Roshan is, is not necessarily a game ender, but it puts Wings in such a good position to be able to take another set of racks, I mean pacemaker, to keep themselves in the game. So they bait out the DK's BKB. I actually think that going on Chen, I mean, yeah, I kind of get it. You want to kill the guy who has the pipe and the mech, but he's nobody so else. Yeah, he's so tanky. And nobody else from the team was even there. XD getting oh, right into the face okay. here. Frogs, four staff out from JDH. Callout's going to be there as well. Blink doesn't even care. He's just sitting there auto attacking. He will probably get his Aegis popped here. Where did and he will this? indeed. There's no ravage. I yeah. think he actually dies again. Yeah, well, unless he could BKB, but it looks like. Okay, they will see it right now. They hook on the deep, or actually four staff on the background. Call down is going to hit just about everybody. I'm not sure exactly what was stolen. DK form being used by Pipe, letting them retreat. DK doing a little bit of harass. BKB has to be used right now. It's actually going into the lion's mouth of that juggernaut. No only stash is used right now. And the egg's going to be used on the back line. Rabbit's going to hit. It looks like DK is dead on the second TP out. He would not make it home. And double buyback needs to be forced right now. I don't think DK has buyback from that. No, he doesn't track. have buyback. That cog actually hurt Energy Radiant Pacemaker so down. unbelievably bad. Like, they wanted to go in, but as soon as he dropped the cog, nobody from EP could follow it up. They're going to force the buyback here from Fan right now. And this is make or break for EP. I think if Wings get even a little bit here, they could go for double racks. Okay, another buyback coming in from Lina. Radiant Phoenix trying to do what he can, just dealing a little bit of damage to force XCD back. They do have another Ravage still. Yep. Not using it just yet, though. He might be using it soon. Flak, I think it's down. It's down for like 20 more seconds. So I think Wings, happy with what they got. Double buyback and melee racks. They'll back off for now. And Juggernaut could yeah. not attack in. So the Cogs has been uh, kind of pretty pivotal this game. Roshan trying to get sneaked. Well, Ancient's okay. gonna scout it out. Anymore. Well, they're now kind of stuck. Rabbit's gonna hit, and the egg's gonna be on the high ground. Second Rabbit's gonna come through. They gotta heal the heroes. Can he pop the BKB? No, he cannot, so no satanic. And meanwhile, the Dragon Knight's trying to fight. There is no more buyback on that gyrocopter. On the low ground, they're throwing everything on the Shadow Beam. The Shadow Beam's so tanky, though. That's gonna be it. GG called an energy pacemaker. Drops game one. So, I gotta say, I didn't really have full faith in Wings draft this game. I will admit it. I thought that it would have been very difficult for them to win, but they went with the age-old strategy of just making it so you couldn't actually farm anywhere because of just constant pressure. And here comes in July. In my opinion, really solid performance out of him in general. He gets Fan killed before he's even able to pop BKB or Satanic. The focus fire from Wings in this Roshan fight being pivotal and taking the game.